Okay, here is your new app. And I just wanna quickly go through it to show you how it works. As you see, when you put your cursor over it right here, um, it's a highlight, so that's what will happen within the app. But here are the uh, different areas that I've included, and I'm just gonna quickly go through those. First one, schedule, you click on it, it pulls up your schedule. When they click on this, up comes the schedule. Bring it over here so you can see it. And there is the schedule. Second thing on here, back to the home, directions to the Renaissance. There you see it. There's their contact information. You click on it. There's the picture of it. And they can click on this, touch that button, and it will call them. This right here, the upper right corner, that's for GPS directions. You click on that and it will GPS right to the place. Take Get them some good directions. So back out of that. Sponsorship and vendors information. These are all the sponsors right off your website. I pulled them. These highlighted ones are the ones that you already have links set up for, I guess because they're uh, a different kind of a sponsor. Membership information. Always good to have this within an app. So um, you've got everything in here uh, about mem membership. Plus, if you have anybody that uh, is not a member, they've got a new profile registration form right here. Uh, and contact. These are all direct links to uh, back to your website for contact information. Email. This is and it, boom. You click on this and it's a direct email to um, actually it's to info at cspnet.org. So it automatically within the app when they click on it. Uh, let me shrink this down. Uh, as you see, when they click on it, this is who it goes to right there. They put their subject line in. This is my signature. Uh, but it automatically opens up their email and then they can send a note to you. Oops. So let's get out of that. Uh, the next thing is the agenda, agenda and speaker information. Here you go. This is the full agenda. And again, let me get that into our screen area. So this is the, the full agenda. That'll be right there. It immediately opens up on their uh, mobile device. Scroll down a little bit. Speaker evaluation. This is what you gave me, Diane, but I added some things. May not want them. Uh, I've got this set as optional. They don't have to put any of these in here. Their name, there's mine. They don't have to put anything in. Uh, their email address, They again, optional. The date, if they want to, they just gotta click accept or not. They don't even have to touch it. But here's what you wanted. Just to keep confusion out, by the way, I did this rating scale just a little differently than yours. Uh, one through five, yes, but uh, I didn't want them to be confused. So uh, was the speaker's delivery professional? They just click this or here, wherever, just anywhere on this, and it's boom, there it is. I agree, strongly disagree, whatever. You know, all the way down to not, a, not, not applicable. So being put in there, so I strongly agree. Did you receive value? Uh, yes, so you agree. Did the speaker stay on subject? Oh, I'm undecided. Uh, was the topic informative? You know, so these are all yours. Uh, would you see the speaker again? Yes. Takeaways from the session. Um, you know, they, that's again an optional field. They can say, um, um, you know, oh, I can um, loved the info on social media. Um, overall, what would you have us do uh, differently? I don't know, more coffee. All right, now this one, workshops. Would you like future conferences to have workshops like these? Again, a drop down, yes or no. So we'll say yes. Additional comments, just, just uh, they can put whatever, you know, don't have to have anything. This area here is mandatory. So trainer and session notes. Now this is mine because I was playing around. But let's say this was um, the information on you know Barb Bruno. So we're able to put that in there. This will actually show up. I might change how that looks. Um, actually, I will change how that looks. Anyways, um, so then it's done. And now this, you hit send, and this sends the form, and this goes directly to the info. At, um, well, the email address that I had in there I showed you earlier.
that's uh, the speaker evaluation. Let's get out of that. Uh, Facebook, uh, when they click on it, there's your Facebook. I've got this API'd right on over to your Facebook account. So it always continuously updates as you update it. Twitter, same scenario right there. See the, the last Twitter is what, 15 hours ago. Um, so everything's set, it is ready to go. Uh, take a look at it, let me know if you need any changes.